Max Clifford's daughter Louise has died aged 51, it has been announced. Louise, who co-founded the PR agency, Born Media had privately battled cancer but tragically lost her fight on Tuesday. The businesswoman was with her family at the time of her death. Taking to Instagram, Louise's colleagues shared the heartbreaking news, writing, Heartbroken to write this post and inform you of the passing of our business partner, Born co-founder and dear friend Louise. Following a short battle with cancer Lou passed peacefully at her home surrounded by loved ones. Her Born PR colleagues added, Lou was so very proud of Born and all that we have achieved together, and though we can't imagine how without her, we will carry on making her proud. She can now be reunited with her mom and dad, free from pain and safe in the knowledge she was much loved, respected and will be missed by so many people whose lives she touched. The post was instantly flooded with messages of condolences with dancer Danielle Pizer penning, such sad news, sending my love and thoughts to you all. Such sad news. So sorry for your loss. Thinking of you, typed Jenny Falconer. Another penned, so sad to hear. Sending you all a massive cuddle. It was such a delight to meet and work with Louise. Wishing you all and Louise's family the best through this difficult time. Former EastEnders actress Patsy Palmer commented, So sorry for your loss. Louise's pal Russell Kane also took to Twitter to share a touching tribute, writing, R.I.P. my lovely friend Louise Clifford. Despite endless awful illnesses and countless major operations, being often confined to a wheelchair, she never once complained. We would laugh, joke and take the pee out of the world. She was an inspiration through her courage and resilience. Despite having been diagnosed with rheumatoid arthritis, Louise refused to let this take over her life and once said, I don't really have many bad moments where I feel I'm missing out on things. I'm really a positive person, that's my nature. The PR legend in recent years had fought to restore the reputation of her late father, Max Clifford who died in 2017 during an eight-year sentence for indecent assault. Max died aged 74 after collapsing in His Majesty's prison Little He in Cambridgeshire, their years into his sentence. At an inquest, Louise said in his dying months lacked humanity and dignity, adding that she could see that he was fading. In a bid to clear Clifford's name, she wrote to his lawyer and personal doctor in desperation as she feared he was dying. I was desperate for him to have his day in court and a chance to clear his name, 